All right, so Lineage 2, a game developed by NCSoft that was released all the way back in 2003. And you know what? I felt a little nostalgic, so I had to go back to this game. And let me tell you what I think about it in 2022. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe, give me a like, hit that notifications bell, and let's go on with the video. Alright guys, so you probably realize that by my thumbnail, that was the most boring hour in my whole entire life. But before I get to it, let me explain a few things about this game. So I actually played this game all the way back in 2003, 2004, and I left after a week. Now the reason for that was back in the day, this game was really PvP or oriented, and that was the early 2000s. So it was a little bit different when people did PvP. Pretty much, I remember starting on a cave with my character, and the moment I stepped out of the cage at level 1, someone was right outside to murk the hell out of me. But you know, it has been almost 20 years, and yes, I did try to come back to the game years ago, and a lot had changed. And one of the reasons is this game uses Unreal Engine, something that a lot of games, like Rappels for example, that I talk in the channel, they decide to go with a homebrew engine, what means you can't really change the graphics of the game, what is not the case with Lineage 2. And what do I mean by that is the graphics look pretty decent. Because the moment you use Unreal, you can just update the engine, you can make small changes, instead of having to build the game from the ground up. So you guys are now probably wondering, why do I think the game was so boring for the whole hour I played? Well, that's a problem you see with a lot of those older games, just like Rappel's, is that the game really does not start until you're really high level. Now, a lot of games do this thing in different ways, Usually they make various challenges for you, so you can go leveling while you learn how to play the game. And do you think that's what Lineage does? Um, not really. So, pretty much what Lineage did was it made completely easy, to the point that it's impossible for you to die, but you still have to go through the motions of killing your enemies and leveling pretty decently fast, but you still get at some points where you have to kill an immense amount of enemies that really pose no threat to you. And that's where I'm going with the whole boring. And I know if you guys play Lineage 2, you're probably gonna be telling me that I just don't get it. You know, they're making it easy so you can learn the game and learn the map and stuff like that. Well, let me tell you this, it's fine, I get it. It's much better for me to not have much challenge but when you get to the point that people are not even scratching a little bit of damage to you, it becomes really hard to get into the game. Now, I do understand the concept, don't take me wrong. I'm gonna still keep playing the game because I do want to see how the game is in higher levels. I am not talking to you guys saying that this game's a bad game. Look, the game came out in 2003. And honestly, it still have a very high population right now, so the game cannot be that bad, okay? Now, the only thing that I really wish I had was just a little bit of a challenge. I'm not saying anything that would pull me off the game and feel like I'm never going to get anywhere. Um, it's just a little bit of a challenge, a little bit more of trying out combat would be great. Because right now at this point I'm just clicking the same button, or maybe two buttons, and it's getting me to level pretty high. But by doing that, it's not really teaching me much about how to get into more complex battles. Now, to be honest, the game in general, I know it has a really big following and a lot of history in the game. It is a game that I plan to be playing for the long run. And I just can't wait to get to that point where I'm actually feeling like I'm doing something and not just going through the motions. Now, what do you guys think? Have you played this game for years? Are you playing this game right now? When did you start? What do you think about the game? Let me know in the comments. Again, I know it's a short video, but it's because 
I got real burned out after one hour, but I will be updating you guys about what I think about the game later on. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget, subscribe, give me a like if you like this video, share with a friend, hit that notifications bell, and as always, I'll see you in the game.